All right, hey, this is Jesse with Create This. All right, today we're gonna to remove these two 980 Ti's and we're going to replace them with a single 1080 Ti. We're gonna upgrade our Hackintosh to a new version of a web driver that supports the 1080 Ti. There's the SLI bridge. That's one. And there's two. And there's our new radiator. Looks to be exactly the same size as the old radiator. Comes with what looks like a plastic wrapping on the outside. And on the other side. I guess people are more into their, the way their GPU looks than I am. This is, this is extremely overkill for me. I'm more interested in what it can do. All right, very thorough packaging there. Comparing this with the old 980 Ti hybrid, the outer casing looks pretty much the same. DVI-D, not sure how many HDMI ports here. Let's, let's find out, it's a good question. Looks like one HDMI and three display port, just like the 980 Ti. Back of the unit is also very similar, so very similar packaging. There we go. A little bit of trouble getting that power supply or power cable in, but it went in with a push. All right, radiator's installed. Let's boot it up and see how it goes. Hey, listen, I know on a lot of other channels, people get stuff for free and review it, and maybe they don't like it, but they feel like they have to, you know, give it a good review because somebody else paid for it or gave it to them for free. That doesn't happen here. Both of these cards I bought with my own money for my own personal machines uh, solely because I think they're kick-ass cards. So if you'd like to get your own 1080 Ti or 980 Ti, check down below the video in the description. We have links for both of these. They are affiliate links, but it doesn't cost you a dime extra. It just helps us support the channel. Thanks for watching and please subscribe.